What's going on guys, Andrew here. Welcome back to On Feet. This is where I check out new and old sneakers. I unbox them, give my first impressions, and after that, I show them off on feet. Today, we're gonna be checking out a 3D printed shoe, the Adidas 40 Forward 2. And when I tell you, this is one of my favorite pairs of Adidas I've ever bought, and I absolutely love these shoes. I wear these shoes so freaking much, like more than I probably should, but I absolutely love them. They've held up so well. The grip on them is amazing. They use continental rubber. They're actually slip resistant, believe it or not. I have worn these in oily areas and I don't fall, like it's really good. The design of the actual sole of the shoe is very solid. This is one of my favorite colorways from Adidas. It's this nice dark gray. It's like, I think the color was like metallic gray. I can't remember, but, or it might've been carbon gray. I can't remember all the way. What sucks though, is that they don't sell this colorway anymore on the Adidas website. It retails for $200. Unfortunately, it retails for $200. Um, you're gonna pay to play for sure with this one, but it is worth playing. Instead of $200, I think I paid only like $100 for these, so it was $100 off. I got this discount on the Adidas app last year in 2022 for $100, so basically it was $100 off. But I went with this color because this is actually the first one I have. The other one that I have is a black and white one. That one's in the closet right now. But I got that one in a size 11 and this one in 10 and a half. 10 and a half fits very snug. Let's just say it fits very snug. Uh, I do wear this one a lot because I like the color even more than the black and white pair. On the back, they have the uh, 44 logo in this nice purplish pink color, kind of like this color. And it's on suede. It's actually a really nice touch. The quality is very nice. I like the little orange accent right there. That's a nice touch as well. Same thing for the uh, tongue of the shoe. There is no actual tongue, so it's just a slip on uh, type of shoe. And like I said, it fits very snug. I run in these. I do six mile runs in these and I haven't had any issues. They're pretty comfortable, but I do wish they were just a little bit more comfy. And honestly, the way to really fix that, if, if they made the sole or the mid, I forget what that thing is called. The insole, the insole of the shoe. They made the insole made out of like ultra boost foam. Oh my goodness, like these would feel amazing. I personally wish that these were waterproof and it would have been pretty hard to make them waterproof obviously, but I feel like they could do something with the design of this where this is, the 3D is enclosed. I don't know how they would do it, but they could possibly make this waterproof if they just added Gore-Tex on obviously the upper and then maybe enclose the uh, 3D midsole. Every time I honestly wear them, I'm, somebody's like, whoa, those are kind of cool. Where'd you get them from? And I'm like, yeah, they're 3D printed. Uh, these are very light. This is probably one of the lightest Adidas shoe that I have. For the price of $200, I don't know if I would pay $200 for it, but for $100, I guess so. I guess so because it's a newer technology and it's very innovative. I like what they did with the shoe. And I personally think it's one of the best shoes that I honestly have in my collection. And I don't have too many. I only have like 30 pairs of shoes compared to sneakerheads having over 100 pairs. But yeah, if you can get this one on sale, I definitely recommend you grab it. The fit is pretty much true to size, but I would probably go up 0.5 a size, um, especially because of how narrow it can be. Most of the time, the 3D printed shoe lineup is always going to be smaller for some reason. I don't know why but it is a narrow type of shoe. So if you have wide feet, good luck, <laughs> cause it's gonna be hard. You definitely wanna go up a size for sure. Let me know if you would also buy this shoe or if you buy one of the 3D printed lineup shoes from Adidas. And thank you all for watching. Till next time, peace out.